Universal Orlando announced today that the Jurassic World Velocicoaster will officially open June 10th. This new roller coaster, which has been under construction for nearly two years, will feature two launches, a maximum speed of 70 miles per hour and height of 155 feet, and some realistic raptor figures. Let's talk about today's announcement, as well as what we're learning from some new official footage and photos in today's breaking news update. Gregory Hall, one of the Velocicoaster's lead designers, has said, This will be one of the most thrilling coasters in the world. With four inversions, a top hat that riders will be launched up at 70 miles per hour, a 100-foot inverted stall, and more, this could be the most thrilling ride at the Universal Orlando Resort. It will also be Florida's tallest and fastest launched coaster. Today's announcement has revealed some new details about the ride, and the new officially released video shows off some of the POV footage from key moments, including a quick pass by some of the realistic raptor figures. And it looks like we've got our first confirmation of the raptor muzzles seen in the queue, something we've rumored for a while on the channel. The official press release says that we'll come face to face with a few hungry velociraptors who are anxiously awaiting being released from their stables. Official photos for the queue have included confirmation of the raptor statue in the lobby area that we talked about as well. Official details for the Jurassic World Velocicoaster also reveal the name of the 360-degree barrel roll as the Mosasaurus Roll. The official story for the coaster is that it is the latest innovation from Claire Deering, head of Jurassic World. She's trying to drum up business at the park by allowing guests to observe the raptors up close and safely. Owen Grady, the park's resident raptor expert, has his doubts on the new attraction's safety before we board the train. As mentioned before, Bryce Dallas Howard and Chris Pratt have reprised their roles for the ride, as has B.D. Wong as Dr. Henry Wu. And for fans of the franchise, you'll be able to spot all of the raptors, Blue, Charlie, Delta, and Echo on the ride. It's spectacular to look at, says Thierry Ku. Universal Creative's Chief Creative Officer. It telegraphs thrills just by looking at it. We wanted to take this to another level of thrill and really push the envelope. While the Velocicoaster will be a thrilling experience, it will still only require a 51 inch or 129 and a half centimeter height requirement, which means children as young as eight years old may be able to ride. Universal believes that despite the high thrills, this ride will appeal to a wide audience. The Jurassic World Velocicoaster will have its grand opening on June 10, 2021 at Islands of Adventure, but Universal has not yet revealed any plans for possible previews leading up to that date. The attraction has been testing daily and is undergoing its final inspections this week according to the latest permits. Many believe that we might see team member previews in the coming weeks, and possibly soft openings, or technical rehearsals as Universal calls them, by May. Stay tuned to the channel for more information about possible previews as it happens. Be sure to check out the recent video from a few days ago for a construction update and testing footage. And to learn more about the ride experience itself, check out our Everything We Know video on the channel. What about you? Will you be riding this new thrill ride when it opens on June 10th? That's all for now, but be sure to subscribe to never miss an update. And if you like what we do, consider joining our Patreon for early rumors and exclusive podcasts. Thanks for watching. See you next time.